everyone, congratulations on your big day. We're here to go over the simple aftercare instructions we need you to follow to ensure the best results for your new vision. Okay, so let's start by going over all the drops you'll be using afterwards that you'll find in your green LASIK Plus bag. You have your medicated drops. Some of you may have two, some of you may have one, but don't worry, they all have the same instructions. You just wanna make sure you shake them really well. And if you have two, wait a minute between each so you don't flush one out with the other. But you'll do one drop in the treated eye four times a day for seven days. Okay, so then we have your Blink preservative-free artificial tears. These are honestly gonna be your best friends because they're gonna help get you through any side effects you may be experiencing. They come in these little individual vials and each vial has a lot of drops inside it. Just know that you can recap them and save it for later. Today, the doctors recommend you go every 15 minutes to help get you through, only while you're awake. And starting tomorrow for the next month, you wanna to try to shoot for every hour, but the more the better. They're really gonna help you through everything and they feel really good. If you put them in the fridge, they feel even better. Okay, so as far as restrictions, there are no major ones. We just ask you to use your judgment and follow our three-day rule. No eye makeup, no direct water in the eyes, and no touching or rubbing for three days. We're also going to send you home with some protective sunglasses to wear, and we want you to sleep in them the first three days just to avoid accidentally reaching up there and rubbing. Um, and when you're outdoors, of course, we always recommend sunglasses, and you'll be able to wear whatever sunglasses you want because you'll be able to see out of them now. Okay, so now let's talk about what you can expect to experience right after the procedure. It's very normal for your eyes to be super sensitive. You can feel burning, stinging, tearing, itching. You'll have redness. Just know it's all normal, and that's why we want you to go home and try to sleep first four to five hours afterwards. If you can't sleep, just make sure you lay there with your eyes closed and use your lubricating drops to help keep you comfortable. Okay, so now for the first few months, you can just expect your vision to get better and better, but you will have some fluctuation and fine tuning that happens. You'll notice some days are better than others, no two eyes heal alike, so they may play with you a bit and go back and forth on each other. Even different times of the day, you might notice things go up and down, but again, it should just continue to improve. All right, everyone, that's pretty much it. We hope this helps break everything down for you a little bit better, but do not hesitate to give us a call if you have any questions or concerns. Again, we thank you for trusting us with your vision. We hope you enjoy it. And when you're feeling up to it, give us a shout out online, Facebook, Google, Instagram, Yelp, whatever you're into, and don't forget to thank this guy.